morning, guys. Fresh from waking up. That's why I look like this. Let's open an energy drink. I need this really bad. I'm so tired. I'm gonna get ready a little bit. We'll talk when I'm a little bit more awake. <laughs> Cheers. Okay, I'm a little bit more awake now. I started drinking a little bit of an energy drink and I just changed to my fit for the day. I'm wearing this Aritzia bra and airy leggings. I really gotta get this legging in more colors because I literally wear them every single day to Seoul. Good morning, everybody. I think that the reason I'm so tired is because I haven't gotten up early in a while because I've been on vacation, obviously, just waking up whenever my body wants to. I haven't woken up to an alarm for a while. I haven't woken up early in a while and I haven't worked out in a while, so I'm kind of nervous for today. I think it's gonna be a little tough, but you know, we gotta get back into it and that's okay. That's what's going on. Just wanted to vlog because I just posted a vlog and you know it kind of inspired me like let's let's vlog the week to this week I probably won't vlog the whole week obviously but I'll vlog a few days why is it taking me so long to get my earrings in we'll talk more when we're back from Seoul let's go to Seoul Cycle first time back in like over a week Ooh. <laughs> Okay, we're back from Soul Cycle. Hey guys, that was such a fun class. I'm kind of overheating in this. It was Mamma Mia themed. I don't know if I said that earlier in this vlog. And it was just like such good energy. Like everyone was dancing and singing and I love Mamma Mia. So that was so fun just to like listen to all the music. That was a great class. Definitely it felt <laughs> the fact that I haven't worked out in like two weeks. It was very difficult for me to work out <laughs> just then. I was definitely like, whew, my body was not used to that, but I'm glad to be getting into the swing of things again. You know, we're just gonna be consistent this week and get back in shape. But now, you guys, my room is horrendously messy because I did my laundry like two days ago and our drying rack does not dry the clothes. Like it's in the basement and I don't know why. It just like doesn't dry down there. So I have my clothes hung all around my room. I'll show you. We need to put everything away because I just can't have this mess anymore. And we still need to make my bed and everything. I have a call in an hour so we have a sufficient amount of time to clean up the room and get myself ready for the day. It's so nice outside already. I really want to like go on a walk. Let me just pan around for you quickly close over there right there all this just needs to be put away so let's do that quick one thing about me is i'm always watching a youtube video while i do chores or else i'm just not gonna get the chores done today is daniel carolyn <laughs> my room my camera like ran out of storage halfway through so i don't know how much you guys got to see of it but everything's looking a lot better okay i ignored the jacket on my bed because i'm gonna wear that later but i just threw on this skims tank top and i'm honestly keeping my leggings on from soul cycle because i didn't really sweat like a crazy amount now i'm just doing some computer work computer work like i'm literally answering emails i have my meeting at 10 it's 9 15 i got a job for the summer which is very exciting that's always a stressful thing but i just have a meeting to like go over what exactly the job is and like answer my questions before i start i'll probably start doing like some work for them soon i'll talk about the job more when it's like officially signed and everything i have a meeting for that and then i don't have class till one after the meeting so i'm thinking we'll go grocery shopping and get a coffee because i was gonna get a coffee on my way back but the line was like way too long at the local coffee shop by soul cycle i really need to like do a good stock up actually i don't need to do that big of a stock up because mom's weekend is this weekend so we're gonna be eating out a lot but i'll probably just get a few little meal things breakfast things and coffee supplies so i can make my coffee at home for the next few days so should be a good time i love trader joe's i also want to get flowers for my room Oh, I got new posters for my wall. If you guys can see right there, I'll show you a little bit better. I just decided it was time to revamp. The other pictures were a little old. I've got this one of me and Syra and Belf doing karaoke. Me and my housemates. It's like one of my favorite photos. And then here's me and some of my home friends in the summer. They're a little like darker than the other posters, but I'll probably end up switching them again before I move into like a post-grad house. Like I probably will use like my graduation photos. Ew, that's so gross to say. I will check back with you guys maybe after the meeting. See you soon. Okay, I just did homework for like an hour my meeting is gonna start in like 10 minutes i'm gonna take my vitamins quickly so i figured i'd show you guys a little haul of what i take i either take one of these a day like they're both a woman's multivitamin so i don't really need to take both of them in a day these are from alani new and they're like swallow pills but if i'm not feeling the swallow pill i take uh these pills that are women's complete multivitamins from 
Golly Nutrition. I got them sent in PR, but they're honestly really good. Mm -mm -mm. And then once a day, I also take this chewable orange flavored vitamin C tablet from Trader Joe's. It like dissolves in your mouth and then you're supposed to like chug a bunch of water. I take one of those. And then honorable mention, not really vitamins, but I've been trying to take my Bloom Nutrition every day because it honestly tastes really good. They also sent that to me and I love it. That's the vitamin haul. I've been feeling better taking the vitamins. I've never really been consistent, but getting like gummy vitamins makes it so easy to be consistent because they actually just taste so good. So wellness of me. I'm just kidding. Time for my meeting and then we're gonna go grocery shopping. My roommate's actually gonna come, so that'll be fun. Just got home. Here's my new flowers. Guys, I can't like make them look pretty for some reason. Like I've been cutting them and like trying to rearrange them. I just, I don't know why they look so like lopsided. Like they keep like falling over. But hopefully when they bloom, it'll look better. Did a nice little Trader Joe's haul. Got flowers and things to eat. And I just made myself breakfast. I guess it's, yeah, it's 11.40. Now, I don't have class till one, so we're just gonna chill and do work for a while. I'm drinking my Bloom Nutrition. Trying to get in my wellness era, as the title of this video shows you. And honestly, the Bloom tastes really good. I've had the original flavor before and I did not like it. It tasted like dirt. This is strawberry kiwi and it's super good. We're just chilling. I'll see you guys in a little. Hey guys, just checking in. Just did a little light makeup for class. I made a little get ready with me on TikTok. And I just kind of talked about how I read Eli Rala's memoir over break. And it was all about being single. Basically, Eli Rallo like hadn't been single like all of college. And she was kind of talking about like her dating experiences and what she learned and how she like finally learned to be single. And this is such a good time for me to be reading this book because I'm going through a breakup right now. I have been for the past, past few weeks. And I also like have barely been single in college. If you ask my friends, they will attest. But this is the first time that I've found myself single and in like a very emotionally mature state. Like I feel like when I was a freshman and single, I was still pretty immature. So it's been quite a learning experience and reading her memoir was so helpful because she just had such good advice. I said it in my TikTok, but like I was highlighting so much stuff. She just had like so many quotes that resonated with me. That's what I just talked about on my TikTok. I think I'm just gonna keep this outfit on for class, to be honest. I have a class and then I have like a free hour and a half or so. And I'm kind of thinking about going on a walk during that time because it's so nice out. Still wearing my leggings, hokas, and this jacket that I'm literally obsessed with from Newly. I might be purchasing it. I have to decide. I'm gonna head to class. Why is it blurry? Bye. Back from class. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I did leave my class a little bit early because I just didn't feel like being there and I'm starving all of a sudden. Okay, I'm being dramatic. He was like letting us work on this like project and we had the option to leave or stay. So I left because I really wanna eat some lunch. I got this wrap that I was gonna eat for dinner, but I think I'm just gonna eat half of it for lunch and then make something else for dinner with the other half because I just got really hungry all of a sudden. And then I think I wanna go on a walk because it's so nice out. That's all I have to report. Here's the lunch vibes. Gonna put the Franks on the buffalo chicken wrap. And it's gonna be fire. <laughs> Looks so good. I don't even know if I'm gonna need this Franks, but I never hurt anybody. Mm mm mm. So freaking good. If you've never gotten these from Trader Joe's, and you like buffalo chicken, definitely need to get this. That lunch was so good. Sometimes I'll just get like randomly so ravenous in the middle of the day. But one of my goals is to always honor my body, like eat whenever I feel hungry and don't like force myself to eat. So I'm doing that. I have two brand deals to film really quickly. So I'm gonna do that. And then we're gonna go on a walk because it is 66 degrees. I don't have any homework that I need to do like right now. Like I can do it later tonight. And we should go on a walk. I have a three hour class so it'll be good to you know get a little bit of movement in before class all right i just filmed my videos i think i'm gonna change into this workout jacket for my walk because i don't know i just feel like it why is the lighting going crazy i'm working with clinique and their products have been actually so awesome what they've been sending me and not only do they send me the products for myself but also they send me like 250 for me to sample on campus and i've been giving them to like my sorority and my friends, it has been lovely for everybody. Like everyone loves the product so much. But one thing I like to do, I did like to do more in the summer when I, you know, when it was warm, is I'll like film videos that I need to edit. And then instead of just like sitting on my couch and editing them, I will go on a walk and edit them. And I feel like this just keeps me a little bit more active than being like so sedentary, like editing videos. If I'm on my phone, at least I'm like doing something like being active. So I'll just like put my headphones on and go for a little walk. But I think that's what we're gonna do now. I have an hour and a half before my next class and I wanna get these videos edited. So we're gonna walk around campus and do that. Hopefully I'm warm enough in this. It is almost 70 degrees, but it's like very windy. Still 
a little chill in the air for sure. Check back with you guys when I'm back. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. Back from my walk and it was so lovely. I walked like two-ish miles, a little over two. I edited my videos while I walked, which was really nice. Got the work done on my phone that I needed to for the day. Oh my God, the weather is just so amazing. I am just so excited to go back outside, which usually is not the case in a place like Ann Arbor. I'm going to my last class of the day. It's from four to seven, but usually it ends much before seven. So I'm manifesting that happening. And then I will check back with whatever we do next because not quite sure, probably eating dinner of some sort. Good night. Good morning. Looks like a pretty day outside. Hey guys, good morning. It's 7.40 and I need to leave in like five minutes for Seoul. We're starting the day, same way as yesterday, going to a Seoul class because that's just my favorite way to start the day personally. If I'm not getting up and working out right away, it's really hard for me to want to work out later in the day. So we're gonna start the day with a Taylor Swift Tuesday ride. So it's gonna start the day off great. And I just looked at the weather and it's gonna be like 60 degrees today. So not as warm as yesterday, but still warm good for the soul so happy about that okay we need to pick out an outfit for today what do i want to wear when all my leggings are clean it literally like explodes out of my drawer i guess we could go navy aloe set let's rip that well, let me get dressed quick in the set and i opened a little alani new i seriously open one of these a day take like four sips and then recycle it you could tell me it's a waste but i have like hundreds of them so at least I have the mini cans and not the big cans. That would be such a waste. I just don't need that much in the morning, you know? Let's get a jacket. I'm seriously obsessed with this jacket from Free People. All right. Catch you after Soul Cycle. Hi. Need a shower, but first. It's so stormy outside. I know I just showed you guys, but I just walked outside of Seoul into like a torrential downpour, but it's kind of a vibe. Okay, it's not gonna focus. It's kind of a vibe outside. Super stormy and gloomy. Makes me literally just wanna like watch a movie in my bed all day, which I might do. It's only gonna storm for like two hours though, so maybe we'll just vibe it out. I haven't had a storm in so long. Oh, do you see that? I'm gonna shower and put on comfy clothes and then we'll probably just relax because this weather is relaxing weather out from the shower it's still raining a ton outside but oh my god it's literally such a vibe i missed storms so much i feel like you know in the winter obviously you don't have like a rainstorm you have like a snowstorm and i love the vibe of like hearing the thunder and the rain i guess i wouldn't be as happy about it if i had to be somewhere today like before the rain was over it's gonna stop raining in like a few hours and i don't have class until one and it's only 9 a.m so i'm not mad because i can just like stay inside and stay out of the rain but i guess it would be fun if I had to walk to class right now. I see some people walking to class and that does not look like a vibe. I am still on the mission to get my scalp in order. I burnt my scalp really badly the first night there and if you've ever done that you know that it just gets so itchy and like the skin will flake off for it's been like a week now. Every night I've been doing like a scalp serum and I haven't been washing my hair every day but when I do I use my Away scalp scrub and then I like wash it really well. I don't really know what else to do, but so uncomfortable and painful. I got sent some leave-in conditioners as well as the Bum Bum Cream, but we all know the Bum Bum Cream from Sol de Janeiro. Oh my god, I've never smelled a better smelling leave-in conditioner. It smells exactly like the Bum Bum Cream. My friends are obsessed with it too. I gave them to all my friends. I've been putting that in my hair every time I get out of the shower, hopefully helping it to be hydrated. I'm gonna put some by my part. Yeah, see, you can even see it like flaking off even right now when my hair is wet, which is just unfortunate. I think it's time that we go make a coffee. While I wait for this to cool, let's clean my room a little and make the bed. Be right back. Having some Magic Spoon cereal. It's like high protein, keto, no sugar, and it's really freaking good. Just did a lot of work, and now it's time to run some errands. 
because I just have some random things to do. I need to like ship out some packages. I just posted a lot on Poshmark, so some of the stuff got bought and I need to go ship it out. Doing a little activity with Clinique and I need to drop off some of the stuff at my sorority house. So we're gonna do that. All of it just involves the car, so I consider that running errands and then I have class in like two hours. Nothing too crazy. I'm just gonna put on some bronzing drops so I look a little more alive. You know, life is kind of great when I don't have my internship because I can actually do stuff all morning. I'm sure I'll get bored eventually, but it's fun for now. The rain has cleared and it's super sunny now, so that's why I'm choosing to do my errands right now. Check back with you guys when I'm done with my errands. I'm back from class. I don't know if it's the weather or just like my overall mood today. But I am so freaking exhausted. So I'm gonna make another coffee. Oops, I actually forgot to grab an espresso pod. I was trying to read in class. This reading we had to do and my eyes like were not focusing, which usually means that I'm very tired. I'm also wearing my blue light glasses in case it has anything to do with that. We're gonna make another coffee. Back from class, I am so tired for some reason today. I know I told you guys I was making a cup of coffee, but I went to class after that cup of coffee and I was actually falling asleep in class. Like I can't remember the last time I did that. So I canceled my workout for tomorrow morning. I'm gonna sleep in. Clearly my body needs sleep, but we still have things to do tonight. I'm going to a Bumble team meeting. We're getting sushi right now, which is exciting. I can't wait for some soup because it's low key cold outside again. Gonna get some miso soup, ginger salad, some sushi. And then it's my friend's birthday. Happy birthday, Allie. We're gonna go get some drinks at like a little local bar and then I'm gonna go to bed and sleep in, which is very exciting. I'm gonna switch to vlogging on my phone. Let's go pick up that sushi. Can't wait. Must be something that features. Okay, hey guys, my friend has a birthday, little pre-game dinner situation in, we're leaving in 10 minutes, but I figured this would be a good time to close out the vlog. Those are the two days of my life and I hope you guys enjoyed. Quick little fit check. I'm just wearing a long sleeve from Skims and these are like my baggy jeans from Free People. Hang on. I like never wear them because they're like really baggy, but this is a very casual place. So I figured it was good to wear them. I'm gonna put some boots on and jacket cause it's still kind of cold. I hope you guys enjoyed my little days in the life, wellness edition, getting back into the swing of things, you know, all that, whatever I end up titling it. I hope you will stay tuned for my next video and I'll insert some clips of our night but can't wait to celebrate Allie. She's the best person ever. Love you guys and stay tuned for more vlogs soon. Bye.